Hi, my name is Nathaniel Rowe. And I'm Ryan Mortz. And we are brand new motorcycle riders. I just got my first bike three weeks ago. It's a 1982 Honda 450. And I got my license about a month ago, and I just purchased my first bike three days ago. It's a 2004 Honda 599. I don't even have my license yet. I just have a permit. I actually have to be home by the time it gets dark out. It's really Street sad. Lights come on, calls us back. Yeah, I have to come back. It's really sad. Um, but the reason why we're getting our licenses and learning how to ride is because in March of 2009 we were planning a trip to all 49 continental states. And a little bit of Mexico, a lot of bit of Canada. Right. So to prepare for this trip we went on our first ride today all the way from Long Beach to Huntington Beach. And uh, Ryan, what did we do on that trip today? Well first of all, it's a whopping 15 miles there and back. So 30 miles total. Pretty big, big for us. That's really big for that us. That's an accomplishment today. So uh, we went to REI to scope out some light compact gear, you know, some cots, uh, sleeping bags, that sort of jazz. So, uh, Cosmo, what would you like a cot? Uh, I really want to try and get something small cot. Um, I'm a really big person. I'm like 6'3", 210 pounds, and those little mats just don't do it for me. So we really want to try and find some type of cot that I could fit into my bag really small. So if you guys know where I can get one of those, that would be awesome to hear about that. Um, and Ryan, what were you looking for? I was, I don't know what I was looking for. I was just... I walk into REI and I get a glaze over my eyes. And it's just kind of crazy. exciting. <laughs> it's kind of like a hardware store or a... It's like Christmas. <laughs> yeah, it's a great place to be. It's pretty awesome. There's all kinds of cool toys. So Cosmo, what did you learn on our, our adventure today to Huntington Beach? Uh, I learned that I'm definitely going to want to get a bike with a windshield before I go on the freeway for long distances. It's pretty solid. What about you? I learned, that, like we said, we're in Los Angeles. There's cars everywhere. So when we're riding, we've got to be careful. you got to stand our ground and just watch out for all the idiots that are coming at you. I think we definitely learned ways to like become more visible, too. Just riding together helped helped us become more visible, trying to stay together, even though he ditched me. His, his 599 goes a little bit faster than my 450, so there was parts where I was left in the dust. And so, with riding together, it's just like a sense of security that you know we have more people. Yeah, it's definitely there's a team effort, so... We learned a little bit about that today and just how to do that, trying how to communicate with my loud motor, <laughs> um, doing like hand signs and stuff like that. It was stuff that we're trying to figure out, things that we're going to need to figure out in order to do this trip. Um, so we'll be updating this more often and just kind of filling you guys in and what's new and what we're trying to accomplish here. And uh, hopefully if you have any questions or anything like that, feel free to ask us or send us an email, right, and try and let you know what we're, what we're trying to do here as just total rookies. So thanks for watching our first video blog. You can check us out at www.usamotorcycletrip.com. That's right. Uh, we'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye.